in this video we will integrate the layout which uh, cloned which is cloned so uh, first we need to create a project at laravel composer create project laravel slash laravel and project name is a uh, over the project name um, employee management system system employee task management system sorry so this will create a project for me so let's wait for that if the project is created i will come back okay so uh, the project is created now to cd disk current directory employee and open this in vs code so uh, the first step is make a setup a project so first you need to make um, what thing first you need to make a layout folder layouts second ones to make admin folder an admin folder has a layout and layout folder has a uh, piles new folder uh, layouts layout sorry this layout does not make it And layout folder has a file app.play.php so now come to this project that is cloned so open the index file copy that and paste it here so make a setup on that file then uh, next video one by one we will do for all the thing setup so we need the only this file and one is login file so hope you understand me the second thing is open that project and uh, copy the assets folder this one and this one copy this one to that directory in public directory now that's good now come here here we can write instead of this asset and here is enter this one so nothing is here go to down go to down and set up of this this one is it paste it here okay that's good now in the admin side you can make a new file as name dashboard.blade.php so it will extend first keyword is extend extend mean that it will it it can be extended from the admin sorry the name is wrong so that's why it not give me suggestion admin dot play dot php now extend admin dot layout start app so here we go here we come and uh, copy the main thing that we needed so go to top 
what thing we need it I will copy this thing so app main this thing will be needed I, have to, I see this is sidebar yeah that is sidebar so this thing we needed yield content and uh, here we use yield title yield title and there is our project name employee task management system so first thing we need to make a section section and section has title title and title we give dashboard second section content at the rate yield section best or least thing you copied that's good now make a controller php or tson make controller at dashboard controller and dashboard controller and dashboard controller make a new dashboard controller and dashboard controller make a new function index and return that ui here is also make a type view we will return the view return view mm, as name admin dot admin dot dashboard okay now make a route web dot php remove this thing and remove this thing here is a mm, dash, dashboard controller class index function and route name is uh, admin dot dashboard that's correct here is also admin slash dashboard and you can do one thing like that a route route prefix uh, route prefix mm. use route prefix so move this thing and here we write like that so this will be easy now run this project php artisan zero HP artisan zero. This project will run port one two seven point eight thousand slash admin slash dashboard. So the dash Port is coming. This is the dashboard. These all the thing are coming down. So okay, that's great. Now add some useful thing and remove all the unuseful thing. So first thing we need to go to this controller, this dashboard remove the past line it will not necessary this will be okay remove this thing 
also this 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 will be remo remaining remove this thing and uh, also this also this thing also remove this thing okay now reload it what thing is remaining okay only this thing is remaining in upper button but uh, i delete by mistake one thing also this thing to remove and this will be not removed and uh, remove this one mm. remove this one this one and this one okay the three things are left this thing are left and this thing are left okay so let delete sidebar so come here first to delete uh, not this thing first to delete this thing mean this this Thing, to delete this thing okay now this will be remaining and uh, team setting layout option pix header remove this thing also not needed and the uh, app sidebar uh, remove the real name this one this will be okay mm. and component remove all this thing you will not needed uh, also this one be also not needed mm. okay so remove these thing all these thing okay that's great and load it for loading it will take a little bit time because uh, it will load a huge project so that's why it take time these things are removed great now come here ok now the dashboard is ready so in next video we will make admin login system and uh, after admin login system we will make uh, all these crude and then go to employee site so see you in next lecture